Hey guys, uh, you're gonna have to forgive the uh, wonky camera work. I am not a YouTuber, I, but I thought this was pretty cool. Uh, the Mega SDs just rocked up. Um, what's pretty cool about this is it runs what's called an FPGA, and what it can do for us is it, it emulates a, a 32X, a Mega CD, and um, even an original Master System, I believe. Um, I haven't had a good look through the whole thing. I'm sure there's some guys out here who've already done it. Uh, but what I wanted to sort of show is this is an original Amstrad Mega PC. This is basically a uh, uh, an x86 uh, computer, um, and they've shoved in a, uh, a Mega Drive. It's sitting on an ISA card, and I don't think this has been done before. Um, uh, an Amstrad Mega, Mega, Mega PC running um, a Sega CD. Let's try it. So this shouldn't be possible. A Mega CD, or at least an emulator Mega CD, running with an Amstrad Mega PC. The audio is a bit, well, you can hear it yourself. I've only got a, my Bose 3.5mm jack to actually show or produce the audio. So it's a little bit jumpy. I don't know if that's the SD card. I doubt it, because it wouldn't be particularly high bit rate. But check this out, how cool is this? The OSSC is doing an excellent job. You will have to forgive the junkie monitor. Definitely something not quite right with the audio. I don't quite know why that is. But that is awesome, it works. So as you can see, that's pretty cool. Just if you're curious, and I'm not even sure if this is gonna work, I think the battery's run out on this, I need to charge it back up again. If I were to remove and switch over to PC, well, leave that out first. It may be like 20 years old, but it's still fighting. I think it's gonna be moaning about the fact that I've not bothered to uh, Charge a battery. Is it even alive? Thank you, Aki. There we go. So we are indeed. Look at that, 16 meg. 
Lovely. Switch it back over. There we go. And shove that back in again. It's actually been really well made. I'm quite impressed with the workmanship there. You can tell it was a labour of love. Let's get that back in again. And that's the startup screen. It's actually, they've done such a great job of this. This, um, even the software for getting this configured is fantastic.